Hi, little jets. It's Miss Deary again. I'm here for our Tuesday edition of Miss Deary from a Distance. I'm back outside. I want to be outside as much as I can on these pretty days. So trying to get some fresh air. I hope you guys are getting a little bit of fresh air too. It's a little windy today, so my hair is blowing everywhere. But I have some bee facts for you today. So we're going to go over some facts about bananas and bees bears, boats, and blueberries. So it's bee day today on Tuesday, March 24th. So let's get started with bananas. Bananas, like apples from yesterday, float. So if ever you have some water and you try to put a banana in it, it is going to float. Make sure you ask your mom and dad before you do that experiment. There are more than 1,000 kinds of bananas. That's a lot of bananas. Some bananas are red. Not every banana is yellow. Have you ever seen a red banana? I think I've only seen yellow, but I'm gonna be on the lookout for some different colored bananas the next time I'm at the store. You do the same thing. Americans eat more bananas than any other fruit. We love our bananas, I know I do. Each American eats about 26.2 pounds of bananas a year. That's a lot of bananas, not quite as much as apples, but it's still a lot. So remember, if we weighed the banana and we weighed the apple, apples are gonna weigh more, right? So that's probably where the apples come in with more pounds, but in terms of actual number of fruits, it's bananas that takes the cake. So now let's look at bees. If you look behind me, and it's a little hard for me to see, I can't really see, but I think it's about right here-ish. There's my finger, right about there. Look up above my finger. You'll see some beehives. We raise bees in my yard. We have some hives behind me, and then we have another hive that's up at the front of our property and we get honey from those bees. So one of the things that we like to do sometimes is just sit outside and watch the bees. And we're gonna tell you some facts about bees today. Bees have five eyes and six legs. Honeybees, like the ones behind us, live in hives. The average beehive can house 50,000 bees. That's a lot of bees, and we have a lot of bees back there behind me. Honeybees can beat their wings 200 times per second. And the queen can lay over 2,500 eggs in just one day. That's a lot of eggs. Our next fact is gonna be bears. And I'm gonna have five facts for you about bears. Bears are great swimmers. Yesterday, we hoped we wouldn't see an alligator in the pond, and today, as I'm sitting out here, I'm hoping that I don't see a bear. Bears have a great sense of smell, much better than your sense of smell or my sense of smell. Bears are actually related to the walrus, the seal, and the sea lion. Maybe that's why they're such great swimmers. A group of bears together is called a sloth. And the little baby bears are called cubs. That's my favorite baseball team, by the way. Go cubs. Blueberries are our next bee. We actually have blueberries that we grow here as well. So the blueberries are up front. You can't see those right now, but we like to grow blueberries and we love to eat those blueberries at Miss Deary's house. So let's learn some things about blueberries. Blueberries grow on five continents. They're very, very healthy and very, very yummy. Most blueberries grow between the months of May and October, so it's almost time for blueberries. We're excited. The state of Maine produces the most blueberries in the whole entire world. And blueberries start out as being green, but then as they mature, they turn into a purplish, blue color, that beautiful color that we all know and love. And finally, our last word is boat.
boats. And you can see, I think, right here, there we go. There's a little boat that Cooper, my son, and Aubrey, my daughter, use in our pond. And they like to, it has a little trolling motor, or they can use oars, and they can move around in the pond and do some fishing, which they enjoy doing. But let me tell you, five different kinds of boats. We have number one, kayaks. Number two, canoes. Number three, ships. Number four, sailboats. And number five, a fancy boat called a gondola. So little jets, I hope you are enjoying your Tuesday. I hope that you're doing something fun. Learn a little bit. Eat some dinner with your family tonight at the table together. Go outside and play. And I'll see you tomorrow on Wednesday here on Miss Deary from a distance. I miss you guys. Have a great Tuesday. Bye, little jets.